Okay, but first ladies, what a weekend it was. The yeah. sun shone, it was glorious. Yeah. It felt like the beginning of British summertime, didn't it? Oh, it did for me. Jake went off to his dad's. I said I was going to go to the garden centre and I did just that. And I came back and did my garden Saturday morning. It was boiling where I live. Put the plants in, sat down in my bra. In the garden, topping up my tan, I know. It's a walled garden, luckily no one can see in. So um, they can still eat their lunch in peace. And um, did also the same thing I was gonna, that I said I was going to do. My friend came around, I said, look at my garden, look at my garden. She said, oh, it's lovely, yeah. She said, they're indoor plants that you've just bedded. <laughs> I told you, I knew it, but they looked pretty. And I said, I'll have them. <laughs> Apparently they're higher since, whatever that means. <laughs> I don't know, but it was lovely. I loved it. Absolutely. Had the best weekend. Just happy, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, the sunshine yeah. puts a smile on your face, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah. You know, I, I took Ben and a, with, with a load of mates and their kids to London Zoo, and it was just the perfect oh, weather for it. Yeah. Every, you know, even when you were ramming into people with your buggy, they were like, don't worry, it's fine. You know, the sunshine, it no, was happy. Them, was yeah, no. <laughs> oh, moody pants. We'll come to your weekend in a moment. That's a bit more adult, isn't it? What? Oh, well, I had, a, I had a really great weekend. I yeah. know you did, yeah. Where did you spend Saturday day when the sun was shining? Well, um, we didn't get up till quite late because we had a bit of a late night Friday night uh -huh. and I woke up with three men in my bed. <laughs> <laughs> Well, no, I'm not touching it. No, no, no. Who no. sleeps with a cuddly toy? No, no, because that's that's Steve and that's Simon, Who's and the other they're, they're a couple. They're a couple, so they're all right. And then there's me and and uh, Mark. He got up to go and make some sandwiches, and his nickname from those two is the shark. So we got the toy shark and put oh. him in the bed with us. So there's four of us there. So we didn't get up till like <laughs> till like one o'clock in the afternoon. And then I was back in bed again at 8 p.m. because I was feeling a little oh, bit rough. Little oh, you, see, so, you, you think you can party like a teenager, but it all catches up. I can't. It? But it was great. Anyway, it was really lovely. I had a lovely selfish. time. Selfish. Selfish. I had the, I had the Why? most. I had the silliest time because. You know, it was so beautiful, and at 10 o'clock, what happened was my phone died, absolutely died a day. You know what that like? You panic, don't you? So I had to go to Vodafone to have my phone fixed, and also my laptop, and you know how clever I am with them. Well, you know, I've got a dongle. Save and save us. I've got save and save and I've got a <laughs> dongle, which I still don't know what it is, but it plugs in the side. But anyway, <laughs> that's <laughs> fallen apart. So I have to tell you, I was in Vodafone from 10 o'clock in the morning till 4 o'clock. Oh. I know. I missed the whole time. Oh. And I have to apologise to my mum, actually, because she was with me sitting there all day. I had to go and get the girl sandwiches. Poor Shelley, who was doing it for me, because she was starving to death. But I, could, I didn't understand it. I needed somebody to show me. Is it sorted now? It's sorted now, yes. Good. I've got a new phone, but I don't know how to use that now. Don't so speak to Carol. <laughs> <laughs> right, we've Shall all got the same one. Yeah, it was we'll sunny, was it? It was. Oh, yeah. what a shame. Beautiful. See, Carol, you've got a new task. You've taught a save and save as. Now oh, you've no. got to introduce her to the wonders of the iPhone. Oh. <laughs> I will, don't you worry. OK, now the warmer weather's hopefully here to stay. Journalist Toby Wiseman has been weighing up the pros and cons of men's summer footwear fashion in the Sunday <laughs> Telegraph. Now, talking about the shoes blokes will be wearing in the coming months, he says footwear always says something about your character and in summertime it shouts it. So, do we agree with him and is it important uh, what a man wear chooses to put on his feet come in the summer months? Well, I don't do men's feet. End of. I think they're horrible. <laughs> <laughs> Hairy toes, oh, yellow, right, yellow toenails. Oh. Don't get them out in flip flops. It's not right. It's just wrong. Can't bear men's feet. Don't no like to way. see them. No. 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 Haven't at all got yellow toenails. What are you going out with? Oh, you are these men. Dating <laughs> beasts, not men. <laughs> You're not wrong. Yeah. Um, no, I just don't like them. And I don't, do you know what? The thing is, I don't know what's trendy in a man's summer shoe. What about those, you know, those flip floppy things that you don't put your feet in the, in the, and they've just got the strip across? Are they like beach shoes? Oh, Are they trendy? Know. I don't not, know. Not the spongy no, ones no. with the bits around the, the top, two straps. You well, mean? not Jesus like sandals. No. Because no. <laughs> then you're still seeing the hairy toes. What about those ones that are just like toes, the null toes, aren't they? Have you seen them? No. They're like hands. When you walk there, what's that all about? SpongeBob Pop or whatever his name is. <laughs> <laughs> I know. They are. Oh. They, they look all right if they wear nice leather sandals. Yes. You know, like you know, crisscross ones or you know, flip floppy style. But you're right. Their feet do have to be nice. And when I first met Mark, his feet were okay, but they weren't. 
you know, they Fragrant. weren't they weren't up to standard. <laughs> <laughs> what you did, you do. Well, no, I didn't. I didn't make him do anything, right? No. I didn't make him do anything, but I did encourage him to go <laughs> and have his nails done. But we were in Thailand at the time, and everybody does that. People, yeah. everyone gets their toenails done do in they? Thailand, so he did like get it done. So, man with nice feet. Yeah. Thailand, yeah. dear. So, I so, so <laughs> but when he had his nails done, what kind of nail varnish did he have put no, on? No, they didn't have nail varnish. He just had them. They were just nicely, and they just looked nicer. But then. I also had to remind him, he's, he's quite hairy toes, so I made oh, him have his see. toes waxed. Oh! You didn't! <laughs> I knew she was. Carol! I knew she was. No, he thanks me for it, because they do look nice now, and he can wear sandals. Because I'll tell you what, he never used to wear sandals, and he used to wear his trainers all the oh, time on holiday. Smelly. And he had this pair of trainers, and we were in Thailand for two weeks, and he never took them off. On the beach, getting, getting them wet. Oh, they oh, were just... Smelly. They were rank, and we were old, in this... Yeah. They do. And they were in this hotel in Singapore, and I'd come out of the bathroom, and I said to him, Oh, for God's sake, put those trainers outside. They stink. And he just went... They are outside. <laughs> <laughs> and the door was shut. So after that, it was sandals. Uh, so, you know, so I think that the test of whether or not you really start love someone is whether or not you can, you can bear their feet. And I'm lucky. Darren has got actually really nice feet, very brown feet. Oh. And, um, and I, do, I, don't, I do love his feet. Yeah, they're brown. He always looks nice in a, like a flip foot. Well, he won't wear flip flops. He can't do between the toes. No. But, but, he, but we, we have pedicures <laughs> together on holiday. Because I think it's a nice thing to do. You know what the trouble is with Englishmen? Don't they always wear socks with their sandals. No! no. What is that? Why those hairy yellow toe no. feet? And then they have brown legs and then these white big white feet that they have. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Ladies, you're hanging Sports with the wrong yeah. guys.